This is Eddie Hearn, Matchroom Boxing. You are watching Sporting Icons. You don't need to be anywhere else. Okay, so to continue from the previous video where Tyson Fury vacates the Ring Magazine World Heavyweight Championship. So go check out that previous video. And within that video, I said I fully expect Alexander Usyk versus Anthony Joshua next weekend on August the 20th in Jeddah, Saudi Arabia to fight for the vacant Ring Magazine Heavyweight World Championship. Not even an hour later, lo and behold, the Ring Magazine have confirmed that is exactly what is going to be happening. No word yet if the WBC belt might be on the line too. It could be, okay? So don't put it past anybody for that to happen, okay? But that said, the Ring Magazine have already announced that Usyk Joshua will fight for that belt. Now, as far as the WBC is concerned, we'll have to go, we will really have to wait and find out um, as to what's going to happen. My understanding is that the WBC, because they have acknowledged Tyson Fury's retirement, they will, in fact, take the belt off him. And they did say some odd months ago that if Fury re retires, they will do a eight-man tournament for the WBC vacant World Heavyweight Championship. Again, as per yesterday's video, go check out that one. So this is why you should be subscribed, right? Now, the Ring Magazine, the Rocky Balboa belt, should it be on the line for Joshua and Usyk? Well, it is number one versus number two. Now Fury has retired. So, yes, that's usually how it is. But again, it wouldn't have surprised me had they have held it back a little bit and said, we're going to put it on the line for Undisputed. But at the same time, Undisputed, now Fury has, a, looks like he's officially retired, is now going to be waiting around for a long time as far as Undisputed is concerned. So, when they stripped Tyson Fury originally, the Ring Magazine, after his uh, comeback fight against the first of Ferry, they said that they weren't going to put it on the line until an Undisputed fight was going to be announced. At the time, they were looking at Joshua Wilder, right? Of course, that fight never materialised. Then, then they agreed to put it on the line for Fury and Wilder. They kind of went against what it was that they were saying. But still, fast forward to now, it is number one versus number two as per their rankings. So, yeah, it now just adds that little bit of extra to this particular fight. Joshua has never held a Ring Magazine heavyweight world title before. Usyk has, of course, at Cruiserweight. But anyway, that is the news. Drop me your thoughts, click thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next video.